Hello and welcome to The Secret Way, Thief Power Mission by Hengis. I'm just going to go straight to the objective screen and then read the briefing text. It's a little quieter here. A friend and fellow thief named Holman has been nabbed by the city watch and thrown into the lockup. Seems Holman heard the rumours about an old secret way leading from the Hammer Cloister all the way to Lord Binford's Manor. Holman had somehow gotten hold of a cloister key and was poking around when he got caught. Rescue him from the lockup and see what he's got to say. If there really is a secret way, it's just what you've been waiting for. Visit Holman at the city lockup and spring him. Make this night lucrative, get at least 1200 loot. Let's go up. 1500 loot and don't kill any innocents, they're harmless. When you've finished with everything, get back home. Let's go up to thief difficulty. Rumour has it that the armed guard who usually patrols the rarity shop on Water Street is off tonight. Well, this may or may not be true, but find a way in and help yourself to the valuables. Get at least 2,000 loot. I don't know if the uh, loot gold is going to be a problem, but I can manage if it is. Um, though I do like having extra objectives. So let's see if we can find out what uh, Holman can tell us about this secret way. One of the things that me said here... Yeah, oh, carrots. Bread. Going to work great already. Now, of course, this being a mission for Thief 1 originally, this probably do not do anything, right? Let's collect all our equipment from our uh, little staff here. Day 67. Poor Holman, sitting in the town jail. The hammers caught him sneaking around that cloister. After a sound beating, they turned him over to the city watch thugs. I think they're planning on shipping, shipping him off to Cragscleft. Ah, it seems Holman heard the rumours about a secret way running from the hammer cloister all the way to Lord Binford's manor house and decided to find out for sure. I don't know how he did it, but somehow he acquired a cloister key. Only the high priest Tottenheimer is one of those. Holman's not a bad bloke, just a little clumsy. I think I'll pay him a visit at the city lockup and see what he's got to say. If I spring him, he'll owe me. Anyway, I can't let him end up at Cragscleft. He wouldn't last a night. And the guards are happy. It always seems very, it's always very weird to me when people make this compass object that you can pick up. I mean, yes, this is my inventory, but to me it doesn't have a physical presence. To me it's a representation of your uh, sense of direction. Uh, but whatever. <laughs> it's, just, it's not a problem, it just feels strange. All right. But yeah, why am I sneaking? What I was saying is, one of the things Readme says is, uh, because this is a different part of town, we're not wanted by the watch here. People on the street aren't going to be bothered by us just being here. All right. Where are we? That looks like a hammerite place. No, we're here. That's that's. It is a hammerite speak place, perhaps, but it's not the hammer cloister. We need to get in, and it's not the lockup. Okay. Supplies here. What's the objective? The rarity shop on Water Street. So, Holman's in the lockup. Ah, oh, there's the rarity shop. Okay. Yeah. I thought I'd cross the street. <laughs> what was I saying about sense of direction there? Hello, my friend. What can I get for you? Uh, hmm. Point of of. All right then, sir. The next one's on me. No, oh, thank you. <laughs> hey, Jones. I heard the city watch. Tough boys have been shaking you down. Uh, the city. All right, sir. Another lager for you. Help! Police! Oh shit! Thievery! Thievery! Help! Robbery! Okay, they didn't like me going there. Ah oh, shit, he saw me. Hey, 
What are you gonna do about it, huh? <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. Well, uh, that was a great start. Oh shit. This is maybe not how I should have started. Oh shit, this is a dead end. Literally. Alright, well, I know I kind of wanted to let myself get caught there because, uh. Oh, you didn't have a save. Uh, okay. Let's start again. Because it, it was a bit of a misstep to do so soon. I shouldn't have been quite so reckless, I guess. It's my own fault. Alright. If I want to steal from everybody, I've got to make sure they're not going to see me. Alright. Uh, I don't think that triggers anything, but I'll read it just in case. Okay, equipment got. So I could use a water arrow on the torch there. I don't know if that's going to trigger things. Like, I don't know how these guys are set up to trigger it. Jack, like I've always said, you're All the right, best. Sir. Another lager for you? Town. I am the best damn thief in this whole town, don't you ever forget it? <laughs> oh, my Rosie, my Rosie, tapping with oh, the drink up, that I've The night's still young. I would need uh, two water arrows to make it dark in here, so that's maybe not going to be possible. Just might work, working him up or not. I mean, I do want the money. Is there anywhere I can stand where they won't see me? <laughs> oh, Rosie, Rosie, Rosie. How about a pint of my best? Let's try this. Binford and his fancy mansion. Christ, did you stop that blighted singing? Oh, it's a taff. Those damn things. Could I have another pint over here? I can't Please. serve any customers in the dark. Oh no. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, you've been not. Police. Better not light those torches again. And after all the trouble I went to, to, uh... Oh, hmm. Uh, wasting my water arrows already. I'm gonna regret that, aren't I? All for the sake of what? Let's see what's for the sake of... Oh. That all? I guess we get that as well. We do have quite a steep loot goal, so it might be necessary. Now you don't need it. I'm gonna rewind time. I'm gonna keep this in mind. Maybe we come back here afterwards. Hello, my friend. Uh, let's let's not rob too many uh, innocent citizens too close. Okay, so Lord Binford is a place where interesting going. By our secret way, but we can uh, maybe have a look and see if there's anything uh, happening nearby. It's just, what if these windows open? This this certainly ropeable. 
Wow, he's got a lot of guards. Hey, go down to the well and get us some water. Don't worry. I won't spook and hit the alarm if I hear a rat, like I did last time. <laughs> uh, I think that's a conversation from assassins. I'm not sure if it actually got used in the game. Uh, whether it actually plays in Thief or not. There's a lot of a lot of times that uh, conversations. Oh, well. oh someone someone was suspicious of me there. All right. Well, Binford's is we're not going to get in the front door. That's for sure. So, are we going all the way around? Okay, we're back at the pub. Uh, supplies at the warehouse. You know what? Let's do supplies first before we try robbing the. Uh, the other place now. That does open. Oh, don't mind me, officer. I'm just an humble. Nice it is humble, innocent citizen, not trying to steal everything. I wonder if there's another way in there. That's not going to let me in. Anything I can reach from the window, that's that's gonna be it. That's gonna be all. So let's try it. Aha. Well, that's all we need. Good, good, good. Alright, east. It's just the warehouse? It looks, looks warehousey. Maybe? No, this is this place. This Looks warehousey. No, doesn't you fool? Ah, but it gets us to the warehouse, which has a locked trap door, which we're not going to be able to reach by any other means. I don't think. Okay. That's a, I could really go for a pint. Oh, you're going the wrong way to the pub. All right, how do I get up here? I guess I'll climb that down. Oh no, I can't get in there. All right. Need to get into this building complex somehow. No, I'm not scared. I'm just admiring the architecture, not looking for entrances. Not, you know. Not casing any places. Why would you think that? Warning! These premises patrolled by an armed guard. Can't hear him. Oh, I'm gonna need a key. Uh, my, it didn't say anything about it, right? Breaking the rarity shop, okay. I see why it's called Water Street. Hello. Oh, hello. I should have called it Gold Nugget Street. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, nothing making noise now. Don't know what it was. The problem with the. Uh... This kind of thing. It's the like AI thief is not very communicative about being friendly. So those guys were reacting to something, but were they turning hostile to me? I don't know. Wait, saw some help over here, police. <gasps> You interrupt me. So is this opening the door? Oh, it doesn't seem to do anything. I thought it was going to be turning off lights. Hmm. 
Oh, there's no one else in here. All right. Well, we've got crates. If we need crates, if we want to stack crates. Or if we want to find if there's anything hidden behind the crates. Pretty messy made for yourself here, Garrett. Doesn't seem to be anything down here. So it's it's ironically often harder to play around friendly AIs and hostile ones because it's hard to know what will uh, set them off. All right, there's our warehouse entrance. That's what I needed. No moss. All right, I'm just gonna take. There's a button here. I don't think I want to push a random button. Just try and keep the noise down there. Right, that's the, uh, the trap door that goes back down. Got some more water arrows and some holy water. I was keeping holy water in a warehouse, I expected the hammers to have that. Alright. So trapdoors, it's a little inconvenient for rope arrowing, because it's just the thing, but I might as well leave it open. Oh, I could have maybe come in here? No. I could potentially get out there. Let's wait for the guard to pass by. That's a turn. I could really go for a pint. No, it's not the guard, that's the uh, citizen. I have a feeling that button probably just opens the uh, window. It seems to be kind of the thing here in that every door or window seems to have a lever, but I'm not going to test that hypothesis willy-nilly. Okay. So can I safely go out this way? I guess so. Ah, not back in. But that's fine. Leave no evidence. Hey guys. You looking for trouble, Dapper? No. You looking for trouble, Dapper? Why would I be looking for trouble? Okay, pump station is here. Oh, that's where I went in. Okay. I don't have the key to the rarities place yet. Uh, all right, into the warehouse. Let's mark it off. suspicious about how I'm behaving right now, right? Okay. One 
wanted to give him enough time to forget about me. What? I'm not suspicious, I swear. You're looking for somebody else by that name. Hello? If only I could find those texts on the great myth. What place is this? Is it marked? Because we came down here, we're up here. didn't actually spot me. Need to wait till he's not looking in my direction. Wish you had a door, man, in the in your doorway. I wonder what the switch does by his torch. Should we do some science? I'm gonna save scum for things like this because it's such a curiosity. Yes, it's not really. I mean, I could always knock him out, I suppose. Apparently, it does nothing. Oh, there's a light out there. Okay, that's fine. That's cool. Right, it's that light. Alright, so we should be at the lockup button round about now. See what's lockup. On the other side of this building, there's bars on the windows there. Yeah. See what's office of Guinea Beauty. Uh, quite a lot of guys there, isn't there? And this just goes back up. Okay. I have my bearings. Let's let's try that window. Looks like it might be a uh, a way we can get in. Anybody here? Seems clear. I'm gonna leave the rope there because we're probably um well actually. We need to break someone out. So that's a problem. I think I'm gonna have to knock everybody out. Who's in here? I was gonna say, he's not he's coming up here if it's on a call, he's not coming all the way up. <coughs> there are only flash bombs. He's going downstairs as well. I could spend another water hour up here to make it perfectly dark. Oh, there's a flash bomb and some mines. Let's wait for this guy to come back and we can probably just get him on the back of his head. And we did it. 
to wait very long either. Master Thief. Right. There were two on the bed. I have to add to that pile. I'm not sure there's a little one to instruct the others to roll over, but then they're all going to be unconscious, so they're not exactly going to... going to be able to do it, even if instructed. Oh, wow, they've got more water arrows. Right, if I, I want to avoid going into that room, I guess, if I can, that's where all the guards are. I suppose I could have been more stealthy and just put the water out, put the torch out. There's got to be somebody on guard there. The problem is that given the uh, mission's already established that people will relight torches, and that light is uh, getting me here, isn't it? Hmm. You have the key? Now you know what, let's play. Some We've got to get somebody else out, right? So we're going to need the guards. We're going to need the guards not to chase them as well. Let's keep up the bit. Uh, we're going to knock out the entire city watch. We should uh, have fun while doing so. I promise I don't remember how many were in here. going to be necessary. Okay, yeah, it's going to be at least five or six, right? Let's try it. What's going on there? there? You see something? Oh no, three. Ah. It's not the same room I was looking into before, is it? Or maybe it is. Sure, there's, there should be more guys here. I was close. He was just waking up from being blinded. Uh, when I hit when I hit him the first time, so he didn't get knocked out, but uh, he was. Still blinded enough that as soon as I ran around behind him, he uh, couldn't see me anymore. All right. All right. Well, we've got more and more people to pile up here. Then we can go free people from jail. All right. Once he was, once he was no longer fully aware of my presence, I was unable to uh, knock him on the head. Not have to use that second flash bomb. We'll go running in circles like a. I guess this means I'm gonna have to leave town though, because he might recognize me after to after tonight's over. All right. Jailer's log. Still one. Holman attempting to burgle Hammerite Temple. Waiting removal to Grax left. Still two. The rest. Public intoxication. Assaulting a constable. Cavorting with harlots. Awaiting sentencing. So three, four, five, empty. This is the second flash bomb I was talking about. I don't know why I need to see watch key if that's uh Oh, you know what I see here? Possible loot location. <sighs> Who 
would hide loot on rafters, you say? Doesn't look like there is any. But the answer is a sneaky cat that would hide loot on rafters. Alright, let's go uh, get this guy out of the lockup. Oh, he did have the key. Oh, there's another key right there. I didn't even see that. So I could have just stood here and went over and grabbed the key. Never mind. But it's the door that's been neat and tidy. You got it, Holman. You're Holman, right? Garrett. Garrett, is that you? Quick. Open the gate. Let me out. How? Ah. I owe you for this, friend. Here, take this key. Thank you. It will get you into the Hammer Cloister. Once inside, search for the secret way. The secret way will lead you directly into Lord Binford's manor. Now I must go. Wish me luck, Garrett. Good luck. What was that? Yeah, he would have run right past them all. Wait, he locked... He locked the door? I guess it is locked, right? I have the key for it. But he had a key to that door? That seems strange. But, uh, I suppose it's really necessity for the scripting. Right, so I can open all these as well. Do I let you out, man? I mean, I don't know. You might rile the guards up, but they're not gonna... Sure, come on. They're not gonna hold me accountable for it, right? Get out this door too. Alright, that's fine. Okay, so um steal Lord go to the Hammer Cloister and find the secret way. Steal Lord Binford's prized possession, the jar of Kellum. While at the Hammer Temple, steal the mummified hand of Saint Bartok. Also find and steal the crown of Antioch. And break into the rarity shop, which I have no idea how to do. Alright. Oof, that's a lot of a lot of things to do. Alright, well we keep going east. So we've got some things done. I've been in the pump station as well. Let's see what these hammers are all about. Trying to go in the front door, right? Builder grant thee his wisdom, youngster. Thank you. Nothing to see now. Is my close to key to this? Is this the builder's wisdom? I think so. Did you say builder or did you say uh, locksmith? Oh, there's people in there and this noisy floor. Didst thou see that too? Well, 
I see nothing now. Hmm. We could maybe get in a lot of trouble here. Some, I think someone's coming downstairs. Yes, they are. Oh, he's got a key. But he's not coming this way. If his friend hadn't been there at the same time, it would have been a good opportunity to grab it off his uh, belt. But... Maybe there's some opportunity. Stand forth and speak thyself. Oh, you're somebody else. Oh, it's a healing potion. Was well, only rats. One large rat armed with a blackjack and a quick save button. Where's the guy who had the key? One person came downstairs, someone else went back upstairs? Or do they have some magic machine in there that transforms keys into healing potions? That would actually be quite useful, because some keys I don't need anymore. Ah, oh, that might be him. No. Uh, maybe there's another staircase and one guy's going clockwise, one guy's going anti-clockwise. In which case, Key Man should be coming down these stairs again. Pretty soon, but it also means we can find him upstairs. That's the case. So maybe I don't have to worry. There's something over there. I know not what it was. Oh yes, it must be Keyman coming down the stairs now. Well, oh, maybe I can just grab his key then. Ah, oh, no, they've, they've... There's nobody here. Ooh, if we get down... Let's check out this... Crypts. Hmm... I suppose it's a mummified hand is anywhere, right? It's going to be down in a crypt. Right. The mummified hand of St. Bartok. It's a hammerite crypt, right? It's not going to be haunted or anything. I love how perfectly timed that little giggle in the soundtrack happened to be used as I was coming in here. And then of course these guys. It's not going to be haunted or anything. Isn't there? I might want to do it from behind him. I don't know if I can reach it from behind him. Dispose of these guys. Now I have how many water arrows? Nine. I could holy water them. But they tend to take a lot of holy water, right? I might just backstab one and maybe I can holy water the other. I 
Okay, so he didn't actually really see anything there. So maybe I can actually get behind him. There's another door, but... Wakey, wakey! <laughs> Okay, well, you guys have solved your haunting problem. I've also solved your too many mummified hands problem. I'm not sure if that's a problem you realize you had. Well, I'm gonna try the button. Where is this? Oh, this might be the well in the cloister. Don't seem plausible, right? Yes, that would be where I am. Don't really want to be here right now. Not yet. Oh, I've got the rest of this Hammerite Temple to uh, deal with. So why are we going to deal with that? Now is the right moment to do so. You've got a replica eye? Oh no, it's the crown of Antio. Just have to look a little bit like the eye. Let's stop and observe patrol routes for a bit. Coming up the stairs to my right. No? Sounded like it was. Oh, maybe there was the guy going in and out of the room down below, down at the bottom of the stairs. This guy might be coming up the stairs. I kind of want to have a sense of where the two guards are that come up here in their patrol room. There's one, that's Healing Potion Man. Got some metal plates. Who's getting in and out of a door? There's key man, okay. So I suggest this stairs should be pretty clear for me to uh those are not valuable candlesticks. It seems quiet enough now. Tis well. The Journal of Brother Percival, Day 309. There lurks an unholy terror in our crypts below. None of the brethren will venture down to face it. It appears to guard our holiest of relics, the mummified hand of St. Bartok. I do not know what we shall do. Day 314. Brother Tostig has suggested we try entering the crypt through the old well in the cloister. Maybe we can sneak up on the ghoul and vanquish it. So far none has enough courage to venture down the well. Well... Brother Percival, your uh, problem has been resolved. 
I'm not sure why you keep a pet skull here, but uh, you know. Always known hammerites have some strange customs, but uh, yeah, I think that's the guy coming up the stairs now. Maybe. This is kind of an awkward place to be, isn't it? Because one's going to be coming that way, one's going to come in there. Right, uh, go down the stairs and see if it's... I don't even know if it's clear at the bottom. I don't know what the bottom situation is like in terms of the other people hanging around in the temple here. So I don't want to uh, be too reckless. Oh, also... I... Would like to hear what's going on, but there's uh, the room brushing problem. Okay. Okay, the other guy's just coming. I hear the metal footsteps. So he'll be here any second. Let's let him let him pass. And we can kind of follow him down. It'll be that'll be all right. side of the front door, I think? Or is this the temple side entrance? No, is this go to the cloister then? No, do I just pick this lock? I do just pick this lock. It is just the other side of the front door. As I had suspected. Question is, is it worth going down there? Well, we'll have a look in a second. Feels like there might be worth something worth stealing. I don't know. I guess there should also be the door to the cloister area there, right? Um. Oh no, it's not shown on the map. That's the cloister door to the cloister. What's a fountain of maybe holy water? You know, I have not been uh, doing my duty with regards to these banners. I thought I heard rapid footsteps like someone had seen me. I thought I spied something. And it all seems peaceful now. Stairs again. He's waiting for the guy with the key to come up. No, the guy with the healing potion. Well, the guy without the healing potion. You know, you know what I mean. He's gonna be coming up very soon, so. Stupid, so lazy. Don't see why I have to be the one to be put with all these incompetent people. I love, uh... Ah, uh, that voice. I think it's uh, Stephen Russell as well, wasn't it? Beast. Nobody here? Well, let's leave them to their... Leave them to their wondering who's been defacing things here. I just had an idea.
somebody's poisoned the water hole. All these hammers are gonna... Oh, well, they'll probably just find the, the haunts down there and Brother Percival will wonder why they went and fell in the well. But be happy that that means they can now reach their most holy relic and then be a little less happy when they find it's gone. Alright, I think it's just about close to time here. Oh. Did they move? How am I going to get past him? Maybe it's just a little old fashioned sticking to, to walls. Good even. Stay awake. I worry there is something going on. You're not wrong. He's kind of looking this way. Okay, now he's patrolling. That's better for me. I'm going to preemptively put this torch out because it's bright in this room. I do not know if people come in and out. It's pretty cramped. I think that was a pretty good preemption. Oh, the torch still looks lit. Which is... <coughs> Never mind. Minor bug. Hammer book of tenets. Our builder it seems not the vain or opulent. This simple yet steadfast works that lead most straight to the builder's hall. Build not for thy vanity. Build for thy soul. I don't know how... Ooh, careful going. So this guy comes in here, but how often does he come back? Pretty, pretty often. Oh, there's another one. I didn't even look behind me. That means I've got another duty to do here. Here we go. More? Aha. Uh -huh. Be where they keep hide the good stuff, I suppose. Obviously, this guy is get upset when he notices the banner taunt there. Oh, he's he's very upset right now. Banners are self-destructing in front of his face. I realized I didn't really look at this plinth, did I? Oh, he's not bothered by that one. I mean, I guess it was just an expensive tapestry. It wasn't like uh, anything holy to the builder, right? Well, this must be the secret way. We came all this way to find. Oh, strong current. We're not coming back this way. Look, I'm not. I'm not moving at all. I'm not pressing any keys at all. I'm just being taken with this current. Well, just to go sideways, just to go around the sides. Uh, 
have. You know what you have to pay money to have a ride like this. These, these lives, it's the best life. Okay, I think this is Lord Binford's basement by the looks of it. What mysteries does it hold? What spiders do I behold? Those are questions for the next episode. I'll see you then.